We're at Model Sporting Goods in Times Square, New York City, with Christian Lopez, who caught Derek Jeter's 3,000th hit. Now, it was less than a week ago, but how has your life changed since you caught that ball? It's spectacular. It's uh, it's still surreal right now. Um, it's, uh, it's been a little overwhelming the last couple of days. Um, everybody knows I'm a normal guy. I've had over probably 300, 400 phone calls in the last couple of days, uh, text messages, uh, Facebook requests from everybody all over the country, uh, including Canada. Um, it's just been crazy. It's been a good time, though. We know that you did not ask for any money for that ball. Now that you've had a few days to think about it, any regrets there? No, um, I think I did everything I wanted to do. Um, I mean, I got someone to kind of help me out with all this situation, and he's extremely good right now. So, um, I mean, everything I've asked for has kind of come true right now. Um, I'm a part of uh, Yankee history. Jeter made history that day. I got to be a part of it. Um, I'm living it now, and uh, uh, this is just incredible. Proving that no good deed goes unpunished, though. Apparently, you're going to have to pay taxes on some of the memorabilia and some of the seats that the Yankees have offered you as a gift. What was your reaction when you found that out? Um, I mean, anybody reacting uh, is going to be a little disappointed in what's going on. I'm just trying to have fun right now, live with some memories. Uh, and when the IRS comes knocking, I'll see what I can do and pay my taxes off if, uh, if I need to. But I'm not worried about that right now. All right, you got a surprise today. Mr. Modell presented you with a World Series ring from 2009. What did it mean to you to just get this a few minutes ago? Uh, there's still no words for it right now. Um, I don't think I'll ever have words for it. My hands are still shaking. Um, I don't even know what's going on. Uh, it's, it's just crazy. It's, a, it's like a dream come true. Um, it's, there's no words. So what is next for you after all this media frenzy eventually dies down? What happens? Do you go back to being a regular Yankee fan? Yeah, I go back to being a regular Yankee fan and going to work. Um, I mean, I'm still a full-time uh, worker. I need to make a living. Uh, so I'm going to go back to work. Christian Lopez, enjoy your moment. Congratulations. Thank you very much.